When you hear the term poultry, usually this picture comes into our minds. However, there are a lot of other birds that fall under this category. Most notably, turkey which looks like this. It is one of the most common poultry birds with population of over 450 million throughout the world. So guys, today we are going to talk about the differences between two most common poultry birds that is chicken and turkey. Alright, let's begin. Let's start with the physical features. This is the picture of a typical chicken, whereas this is the picture of a turkey. Chicken comes in different colors, some white, some black, some buffy color, some red and several other colors as well. Whereas commercial turkeys are usually white in color, but in the wild you can see very colorful turkeys. In general, a male turkey which is called a tom or stag is more colorful than a female. Now let's closely look at the head of a chicken and turkey. Turkey's head is featherless unlike chickens. Some of the chickens have unique feather on their head like in this picture. If you closely look at these two pictures, chicken has a comb on its head and turkey has a snood on its head. The purpose of comb is to lose heat and attract opposite sex. In turkey, snood serves to attract opposite sex as well. If you look below the head of both chicken and turkey, you can see wattle in both. So there is not much of difference there. However, in turkey, you can see fleshy growths on head and neck called caruncles as seen in this picture. The purpose of wattles is to release excess heat from the body and in turkey, caruncles helps male to attract female turkeys for sex. Apart from the differences in the head area, turkey also has a tuft of long fibers attached to the breast as shown in this picture, which is called beard, whereas chicken does not have this beard. Raised body part of chicken and turkey look mostly similar even though turkeys are bigger and heavier than chickens. Although both chicken and turkey fall under category of poultry, they are very different in terms of their history and origin. Chicken descended primarily from the red jungle fowl which were originally found in Southeast Asia. They were domesticated around 8000 years ago, mostly for cockfighting and later people started using them for meat and eggs. More recently, in the last century, there was a big change in the way chicken were housed and we started seeing intensive housing systems such as cages and litter-based farms. Turkey are native to North America, mainly Mexico, and it was only 2000 years ago wild turkeys were domesticated. Turkey farming in a commercial scale also started in the last century, similar to chicken. We all know how chicken eggs look like, some white and some brown. But do you know how turkey eggs look like? This is a turkey egg, which is slightly bigger than chicken eggs and have brown patches as seen in the picture. So if you look at the picture, egg on your left is a turkey egg and on your right is a chicken egg. Average turkey egg weighs 65 gram, whereas every chicken egg weighs about 50 gram. Usually turkey egg is more expensive than that of a chicken because turkey eggs are larger and turkey lay fewer eggs than chicken. Now let's look at how they grow. Growth depends on type of poultry, for example, broiler grows differently than layer. A bird in wild grows differently than a commercial bird. This graph shows how broiler chicken and turkey hen grow with their age. In this graph, red line shows the growth of turkey and black line shows the growth of a broiler chicken. As you can see here, turkey of same age grows more than a broiler. Therefore, turkey of same age is heavier than a chicken. So guys, these were some of the differences between chicken and turkey. We hope you liked this video. Please do not forget to subscribe to our channel to get more contents like this. And please do share it with your friends. We need your valuable feedback to grow. We will see you again in the next video. Until then, watch me inspire and keep inspiring.